Happy New Year to all of us from Trippy Food. We are on the threshold of 2022, and so we decided we we're going to do a New Year's meal that's comprised of different traditions from different parts of the world. So, um, one of the things that in Italy they do is they have a dish of lentils, and they usually have it with sausage. So we try to combine the Italian tradition with the German tradition. So what we did is we get we get some bratwurst. Uh, bratwurst is a pork sausage. Now pork or pigs, uh, any type of um, pork is a lucky thing to have on New Year's because pigs move forward and um, they're fat, like a fat wallet. So, uh, so pork is always a, a, an important part of a New Year's meal. So we have the pork sausages, the um, uh, bratwursts, and then we made some greens. So we have these southern greens. There's some collard greens, some mustard greens, some spinach uh, mixed in there. And uh, we made that with bacon. So we basically put the bacon in the pan and used the bacon grease to make it. So we've got bacon representing there. Uh, we have our lentils, which again is an Italian dish. In Japan, what they do is they eat soba noodles. And the idea is that the soba noodles are long. So you're supposed to slurp them up without biting them off. And uh, the longer the, so the soba noodles are, the more it represents having a, a long and healthy life. So greens are an important part of a New Year's uh, meal because green represents money. Now typically what we don't have is a nasilopita, which is a, a Greek bread that is made with a coin inside it. And whoever gets the coin inside the bread, very similar to a king cake or a rosca de reyes, uh, whoever gets the coin baked inside the bread has luck for a year. Then a Spanish thing, which actually uh, also uh, migrated to South America is on New Year's Eve, right at the stroke of midnight, eating 12 grapes. So it's one, one grape for each stroke of midnight and it represents the 12 months in the calendar ahead. So we have grape, our grapes here. And then we also have uh, chocolate coins. Now chocolate coins are, this time of the year, are really big for a, a bunch of different holidays. Usually um, they're used for Hanukkah. So with Hanukkah, they're uh, gelt and uh, they're given out, they're usually uh, silver and uh, gold cover colored. They feature on St. Nicholas Day because they're, they're gifts. So they feature on, on St. Nicholas Day. Um, they were given out as a way to, for everyone part to participate and to get gifts. Um, but they're also used at Chinese New Year. So co uh, chocolate coins are a big thing on, ch on Chinese New Year. We'll use these. And um, so we have a fine uh, New Year's meal here, and we're just gonna get, go ahead and get started. So we'll start with the bratwurst. And again, we have our sauerkraut on the bratwurst because sauerkraut is a lucky German thing. It's thought to bring wealth and blessings in the new year because every strand of fermented cabbage represents money. Can't go wrong with the bratwurst. They also believe that eating a soft pretzel brings luck into the new year. That's also a German thing. We don't have one of those. We'll try some of our Italian style lentils. These are basically steamed, a little bit light spices on them. And I'm really looking forward to the greens. So again, we made it in the bacon grease. We uh, caramelized some onions, then put the greens in there, a little bit of chicken stock, let that kind of simmer for a little bit of while until the uh, greens got tender. It was as fine a meal as you could want. So let's try the grapes. So. Again, you're supposed to eat one for every stroke of the bell at midnight. So here we go.
I didn't time myself. I don't know if that worked or not. And let's have a chocolate coin for good luck for the New Year's. And these are coins from all over the world. Like, here's a, here's a Kennedy half dollar, a chocolate Kennedy half dollar. I don't know how you open this. It's really cleverly wrapped. Oh, so the imprint is in the chocolate itself. The chocolate itself looks like a coin. There we go. So much luck. So much good fortune. A little bit of everything, a little bit of different cultures put together for a fine New Year's meal. So, if you've got time, get out, put something like this together. There's other traditions as well. You might try those. But whatever you do, please take care of yourselves. Please take care of others. Please be careful. And we will see you soon. Happy New Year and great blessings for the next year. Thanks for checking out Trippy Food. If you enjoyed watching that video half as much as I did making it, well then I enjoyed it twice as much as you did. And if that's the case, you'll probably like this video right here. And if not, check out this video right here. That one's a little bit different. Either way, leave a comment down below. And be sure to subscribe by clicking on the Trippy Food icon right here. Glad you could make it, and we hope to see you again soon.